Tata Key One Two Three, and uh, this is a coral, a coral feeding video. It's gonna be kind of like a close up, but I'm also gonna show you how to feed your corals. And here we have a shot of the A can. I just wanted to show a few new heads on the side. And over here, there's a few. There's about five new heads on it. And let's get this video going. Uh, one of the things you're going to be needing for this video is a turkey baster, something to hold tank water, and whatever you're going to be feeding your corals. And I'm going to be using baby brine shrimp for the filter feeders, and mitzvah shrimp for like the A can, candy canes, and some polyps. First thing you're going to want to do is shut off all the flow in your tank. Now that that's done, we're going to take the one cup. We're just going to fill it up with some tank water. Just like that. First, I'm going to be using the baby brine shrimp. And you're just going to take one of these cubes and pop it in the water just like that then what you do next is uh, get your turkey baster and you just want to melt that uh, ice And I'll get back to you when I'm done doing this. Okay, and when it's melted, it should just look like cloudy water. And that's all the little baby brine shrimp. So you're just going to fill up the turkey baster with some of that. And just spray it all over your uh, corals that are filter feeders. And they'll take all that in. Sorry, all the corals are a little mad. I had my hand in the tank a few minutes ago because uh, frog swan was knocked over. Give some baby brine shrimp to the frog spawn. Zinnias. Some to the A can, even though I feed him mice shrimp. They'll take in some of that. Oh, I didn't have the camera pointed. So what you do is just spray them over your corals. And use up the rest of that. And I'll get back to you with the mitzvah shrimp. Right now I'm uh, mixing up the mitzvah shrimp. It's the same, uh, same thing. Just swish them around until the ice cube melts and... When they're done, I'm going to take a shot of the egg can eating some. Sorry it's a little blurry, i got to clean the tank. Okay, I'll get back to you. Okay, I got them done mixing now, and I'm going to show you guys the egg can eating some mice shrimp. They're pretty fast eaters, as you can see. And I'm going to start the candy canes real quick. Okay. 
I'm gonna take a few shots of the candy cane. The tentacles aren't really out, but he just ate a little bit, so. Uh, when the candy canes eat, they start to swell up. It looks kind of like a watermelon. It's pretty cool. But I'm just going to finish up uh, feeding the corals. I'll get the frog spawn's not really open because I moved it. So he's really mad right now. But. I'll try to get it to eat. Hold on. See, the glass is really dirty down here. He's starting to swell back up, but I don't know. Some of that shrimp's working towards its mouth. It's not too happy today. I I accidentally knocked him over in the sand. I was trying to clean the glass in front of him, but it didn't really work out. But now's a good chance to show the baby mushrooms. If I can get through this crappy glass. There's two baby mushrooms and then one at the bottom. There's a nasty bristle worm. There's a mushroom. They can also eat mice shrimp. A lot of people don't do that, but I've been feeding mine mice shrimp for like almost, well, since I started feeding my tank. And apparently it pays off because he has a new baby all the time, so I don't know. There's the emerald crab. Back there just doing his job. And that's basically the tank feeding video. Yeah, he's eating. He's slowly. So that's it. Thanks for watching, you guys. It's Hot Dog He123. There's some tentacles. Let me just throw some food in there real quick. Thanks for watching.